Hi friends, today we are going to learn VS of kidney. Again, it's one of the important question that comes in exam. If it comes, it comes for seven marks. Explain VS of kidney with neat and label diagram. For drawing VS of kidney, we need to follow certain simple steps. First, draw the alphabet C. Now this C, little bit more C. So you put it inside. Now this is what will help you to understand. So we draw a C. Now this C indicates the covering. Now we need to go for V. Now V is somewhat like this. So let's take it as V, 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 V. Actually these are renal pyramids which are 8 to 10 in number. Now after that on the V just put one small circle. The circle indicates the opening of collecting duct. Connect it now. This part what comes out is basically the ureter. Connect all the renal pyramids like this in a very simple way so that it's easy to understand. Once we have done this, try to give a covering on the kidney. Now this covering what we are putting is called as capsule. Now the other name for kidney is renal. So it can be also called as renal capsule. If you want, you can go for little bit of shading. But as such, you will not be having time for your exam. So don't go for shading as such. Just little bit if you want. Now this kidney has two entry point. The entry point will be for renal artery and renal vein. Now once you have done this C, you have done the V part, try to understand you need to just draw a line. Now these are all basically collecting tubules. Now this line indicates what? It's a collecting tubule, the tubule that is present in the nephron. So we need to show a nephron here. Now this is renal pyramids which are ready. Let's draw one nephron. It's very easy. See a line and a loop of Henle and that collecting tubule. Once it is done, you need to understand. You need to put a dot dot. Now this is renal cortex. Renal means kidney. Outermost region is called as renal cortex. Which put Each dot is actually resembling a nephron. There are 1.2 million nephrons present in each kidney. So my dear friends, as far as nephrons are concerned, every one of us are millionaire. So we are millionaire in terms of nephrons. So this is how you draw the VS of kidney. Now when you go for the labeling, this part is called as renal capsule, outermost covering. Kidney has two regions. The outer region is called as renal cortex. Now this cortex is dark, dense and granular because it contains nephron which is a structural and functional unit of our excretory system. The inner part is called as renal medulla. Now when you study renal medulla, the renal medulla is somewhat consisting of important thing that is called as renal pyramid. Now when you talk about renal pyramid, it is somewhat triangular in shape this is how we have made okay now when you look at the base of the pyramid the base it is broad and it is towards cortex when you look at the apex it is narrow and it is towards medulla so we need to understand this now there are 8 to 18 renal pyramids that is present in the kidney the renal pyramid has small tubules which are going to open into it. It's a nephrons collecting tubule. This is called as renal column of Bellini. Now, if you look at here very carefully, only this much section is for cortex. 
only this much section is for cortex but some part of the cortex has entered in the medulla so what we say some part of the cortex has entered in the medulla between the pyramids so the part of the cortex which has entered in the medulla between the pyramid that part is called as renal column of Bertini renal column of Bertini now there are small openings these openings are called as minor calyx two or three minor calyx will join together to form major calyx now the major calyx is going to open into a space the space is called as renal pelvis now the pelvis is going to give rise to a tube that is called as ureter there is a notch in the kidney the notch is called as hilum hilum is the entry point for renal artery and renal vein this is all what you can say with respect to vs of kidney thank you very much